uh, hi everyone i hope uh, everyone is doing good today in my session so i would like to give some information about the scp btp interview point of time questions and answers here in that the first question sometimes they may ask you so uh, what is environment in btp what is environment in btp here so environment refers to in btp actual platform as a service environments are the platform as a service right so this will enable us to develop run manage our applications and service so in other words environments are the playgrounds normally in our playgrounds where we will go and play the games right same as like here our applications will sit in top of the environments and will play it here, right? So each environment, so how many types of environments are there here? How many types of environments? How many types of environments are there here? So they are the so types of environments. So we have the types of environments are called the cloud foundry environment, cloud foundry environment, ABAP environment, and NEO environment and schema environment. There are the four types of environments are there in the PTP. The most frequently used one is the Cloud Foundry Why? because all the services will can play and sit into the on top of the environments are. So as a prerequisite, once the systems are, once the BTP sub account you created, so definitely we need to enable the environment otherwise some services will not show in the environments here right so in which scenarios so there are the types of scenario in which scenario uh, we have to use the uh, each and every environment here right so i will explain in detailed way right so in which scenario we will use it here anyhow the neo is going to sunset here right so maybe in 2027 or some sometime uh, there is it's going to be sunset means they are going to remove the neo sub account here right so then how many types of environments we have so apart from that so what is regions right so what are the regions concept regions in btp the regions are specific to the geographical location right so the regions are specific to the uh, geographical locations where we are choosing, we are whatever, right? So during the sub account creation, whatever the region you are choosing that is specific to the so geographical location. So there our applications, data, services will run on in that regions here, in that specific regions here, right? In the specific, the regions, it will go and sit into the, so in that region here right so that is the here yeah. and also the uh, what is the what is the underlying cloud infrastructure what is the so infrastructure what is the infrastructure there is a infrastructure concept in the infrastructure infrastructure concept in the infrastructure what is the infrastructure for sap btp what is the infrastructure for btp here so SAP BTP build on multi-cloud foundation. So that allows users to choose the different infrastructure providers. Means we have the different types of infrastructure providers, right? So like AWS, Google, Alibaba, so then Amazon. So these are the infrastructure provides here. So when you are creating the sub account, we need to choose the infrastructure right so that is the one right <clears throat> can you and also sometimes they may ask you can you explain can you explain the the concept of can you explain the concept of the the global account global account and sub account can you explain the concept of the global account and sub account here so global account is the realization of or contract with the customers global account is relation of contract with the customer here so there are the types of global account enterprise accounts so trial accounts like pre trial accounts the trials accounts are there here right so under the global account we have to so we have to derive we have to create the sub account here so sub account is like a 
so it contains the entitlements quotas right so structure structure of sub account is structure of the our business business account that sub account is our business account where we can subscribe the services applications so we build the applications where we can use it everything here right so global account contains the sub the global account is used to manage the sub accounts members quotas right so and also the customers will receive the entitlements and quotas that will be available in the global account only so from global account only we have to so allocate to the sub account all the entitlements and everything here right so what is mean by entitlements so what is mean by entitlements here right so what is mean by entitle what is mean by entitlements here so entitlements are available in the global account as well as sub account also it is available which means the services which are which you are entertained to use the list of services which are entertained to use those are the entitlements here so normally when when time of the contracting with the customer we will get the global account in the global account you will get the list of services which you are entertained to use so those list of services are available in the entitlements here the list of services are available in the entitlements here right so <clears throat> how many like we can create the multiple sub accounts under the one global account here right one global account multiple sub accounts we can create here right so what is so then uh, then regions so regions also we discussed now so services services what is mean by services what is mean by services services here right so services 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 are widely used term in the cloud computing here right so services refers to the some kind of technology capabilities functionalities in the internet here so different kind of functionalities here so we have to go to there and we have to subscribe it here right so we are getting the so just we have to go and subscribe the services in the here right so which means you no need to physically install anything here just we have to go to the so entitlements and then subscribe subscribe the services then you can start using directly start using the business logic here right so here services so services means what type of services here right so services means so generally they are the main types of services are available in the normally in the cloud computing it's not only btp in the cloud computing there are the main types of services here, here like ias infrastructure as a service right and also platform as a service right then so the software as a service so right these are the some sub types of services are available here platform as a service so infrastructure as a service here so btp btp can be considered as a platform as a service so sap handles that technological and the complexities so that we can focus on the directly building the extension connected to the solutions and everything no need to concentrate on the so uh, installations configurations all those things here directly you can concentrate on the so this business logic here right so that is the one thing will comes under the here so btp is a btp so is the btp is a multi cloud environment yes so is btp btp is a multi cloud environment so btp is a btp sub accounts are like a uh, multi cloud multi cloud environment so which means under the one one global account sub account so we can multi clouds means you can choose the customers to choose the so your own cloud provider like either aws or cloud iws or azure or ibm cloud alibaba cloud whatever the cloud so it's a multi cloud environments also we can also in the sub account level we can choose the so we can enable the multi environment here right which means multi environment means in one sub account multiple environments we can enable it here 
but neo we required the separate sub account we required neo we required the separate sub account is required here right so multi cloud gives more flexibility more more flexibility so the cloud vendors the choice and also the larger network available regions that is our choice which come right so so that is the normally sometimes they may ask you the so what is mean by public cloud private cloud and hybrid cloud here right so that i will explain it and also the different types of different types of different types of the pricing the pricing models the pricing models in different ways of pricing pricing models in btp so we have the different types of pricing models in btp here right one is the so free free services are available as a like sub, uh, subscription based services and consumption based services are available here right so in the consumption again we have the cpa in the consumption based means we have again so uh, pay as you go model commercial model and also the cpa commercial models are available here so if you see my uh, my uh, one of the videos in the my channel you will get the full clarity on the types of pricing models and everything here right so that is the pricing model pay as you go model and also uh, and the cpa so cloud platform enterprise agreement here right so and also they may ask you some types of the pillars types of services here can you elaborate services here services and solutions provided the btp what type of solutions so sap sap consider these are the five types of five types of pillars five types of pillars in so pillars in btp right so one is the it's a main important application development related services application development related the second one is called the automation kind of functionalities the third one is called the integration related services and everything here the fourth one is called the data and the analytics here data and analytics here the fifth one is called the ai artificial intelligence related services a core a cockpits these are the things are available in the so btp here right so these are the each pillar normally five types of pillars and each pillar has some set of services and solutions are available here right so can you explain how btp different from scp right sometimes they may ask you how the how the btp is different from sap cloud platform right how the btp is different from the cloud platform here so normally we know uh, maybe if you see my ch my channel videos sap cloud platform as earlier so normally in 2021 so uh, they have rebranded their word from sap sap cloud platform to the btp here right so sap cloud platform brand officially retired right it was officially retired in the 2021 so support so so the better naming convention sap btp was introduced as a new brand name in their so in their uh, area in their portfolio here so btp provides so not only just cloud related this providing more extended functionalities however the core skill is equivalent to what formerly known as so sap cloud platform the core services are cloud platform but they are providing more than that to better naming conventions in they have so rebranded the word is the btp right btp is not a one to one replacement of the cloud platform it makes only so it's a just they have rebranded their word to sap cloud platform to sap btp here right so and also btp cockpit what is btp cockpit here what is btp cockpit <coughs> btp cockpit is a web based tools so it provided under btp all the services solutions all it's kind of one cockpit 
so same as like amazon cockpit so btp is a kind of web based tool it's a all offering development administration activities all kind of things we have to do it here so managing configuring the sub accounts application services everything here so we have to do it here so so that is the one so normally is there any other way apart from that web based tool is there any any way to do it means so btp cli cli also using the command line interface tool using this one we can also manage the btp accounts here it's an alternative to the cockpit here right the users who prefer to working on the command line it's a client server so it's a client installed on their local computer it interact with the btp server here you can connect to the so btp server here right client server here right so that is the one one way we can use it here right so what is so what is discovery center and also you should know like you should know details about the sap discovery center discovery center so in the discovery center is one stop solution for the all the btp services whatever we discussed with the five key pillars in the btp all the list of services new services upcoming retired all the services means one word one stop one stop shop to get all the list of btp services with the details and the pricing and all the architecture patterns and all the details we can see it in the discovery center right so that is the very very important here right so discovery center so like that <clears throat> so this is my uh, first video so like that so uh, i will do more sessions on the sap btp interview point of time sessions and everything with the detailed explanation so uh, i would request i would request everybody so please subscribe my channel to get more uh, workable videos and knowledge so thank you so much everybody